Hello guys, welcome back to my channel, Kita Zero. If you are new here, I am Key. Thank you for tuning in with me today. And if you are already ready, goodie, thank you for returning. So I'm not entirely sure what happened to my footage after that introductory footage, but as you can see, I am going to be doing some cleaning. So I'm going to start in my kitchen. I needed to wipe down my refrigerator and I'm going to be doing some dishes as well and i'm going to just clean this whole kitchen area because it was very very messy so we are finally getting more and more settled in and getting into the swing of things and i am just still putting some pieces together and trying to bring everything together to make this little space a home for the time being and we're excited we love it it's really cute and i'm just happy so in this video you'll see some pieces coming together as well so i hope you guys enjoy this video and stay tuned and thank you for watching and oh one more thing in this space we don't have a dishwasher like we did in our last space but i'm kind of okay with washing dishes by hand you know is kind of bringing me back to my younger days where my mom used to tell me you better do those dishes and so it just brought a nostalgia moment back for me and i'm enjoying it for the time being of course until they get overwhelming but i'm trying to stay on top of it but i just wanted to share that with you guys Okay, so I finally have my moment to be able to sit and chat with you guys for a little bit. You guys see me clean up the kitchen, the most part of it. I had to do the rest of it off of camera because my camera was dying, one. And two, I started talking on the phone. And talking on the phone is like an adrenaline push for me to be able to finish doing whatever task that I'm doing. For some reason, when I talk on the phone or even like listen to music it gives me that push or that motivation rather to be able to continue to do what i'm doing so that's what i did um and i showed you guys how it looked once i finished the product well finished cleaning <laughs> the product but um i still have some things to do not to settle into i'm sorry Jesus. i still have some things to do to settle into our place i have some things that i need to put on the windows as far as curtains i don't have any curtains or anything like that yet so i'm gonna get some of those hang those up and like some stuff for the bathroom and, you know things like that so yeah um i'll probably head out either today or tomorrow to you know try to get some a few things to kind of touch up the place and i'll just show you guys that but right now, we are just going to let these boys nap, and I am going to watch a little bit of a TV to relax. The older kids are at camp, and we'll see what happens for the rest of the day. Okay, guys, I'm going to piece this somewhere into the vlog, but I am giving Joseph his first foods, and I want to record how he likes it, so let's see. Okay, so we have his regular breast milk in a bottle. I had to throw this out so I could be able to make some oatmeal mixed with a little bit of bananas. Very, very little. And let's see. Oh, I also put breast milk in that too. So whatever he doesn't eat here, he'll just finish drinking his milk. So this is just the taste to see how he likes it. Let's try it. Okay, here you go. <laughs> you see it's over the camera. You gotta take your hand out your mouth though. E -e. Let's try. You gotta take your hand out your mouth. E -e. You don't like it? <laughs> you don't really like it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Just try it, baby. 
Ini ini. You don't really like it. <laughs> you said no, mommy. I just want milk. That's what you said. He probably not gonna eat all of this, and that's okay. We just wanted to try it, and I just wanted to catch it on camera so I could share with you guys too. So. I guess we'll go to the bottle and let him drink his bottle. <laughs> That's enough, right? So guys, I am out and I ran into Target. That's where I am now. I'm trying to get a couple of things for the house like I told you guys um, before. And it's so hard deciding on pillows. Like, I don't know what type of pillows I want to put in my living room for my couch and I still haven't decided on a rug. So I think, you know, I have to get the rug first so I can draw everything in. But yeah, I would like to show you guys what I got so far. So these are on sale for 50 cents. And don't mind the Starbucks because you can never come into Target and not have Starbucks. And we got these bowls, just a couple bowls for like popcorn. I got some hangers here. And I got a rug that says our nest and then i got another runner rug that's to go in front of the door and then i have an adjustable stand so those are just a few things i feel like i'm gonna have to go into another store and maybe big lots and walmart to kind of find some decorative stuff some more decor because i'm not really seeing anything in this target today which is surprising because they always do it but I'm not seeing anything right now. But if I get anything else, I'll just show you guys more of what I have probably later or as I'm picking it. I don't know. So stay tuned. If I gave you my heart, you could tear it apart. guys so i was trying to vlog inside of big lots and walmart but because time was drawing near for me to get the kids from camp i was unable to vlog in those stores because we were moving pretty fast joseph got extremely fussy jackson started doing his thing so it had to be an in and out process and was no time to pick up the camera but i can share with you guys what i got okay so this is what I got from Target. I got two of these. I also got this from Target. Um, I showed you guys this already in the store. So these two bowls I told you guys about in the store and then these two bowls and these two cups. Don't mind the junk back there, we are still unpacking. Then I got this for my bedroom. Um, also I got this tub stopper. And then I got two packs of these to go under the rugs. Then I got this rug from Target as well. That is all for Target. Let me show you guys what I got at Big Lots. This from Big Lots and two pack of king size pillows for $20. That is a steal. So I got those to go with the other pillows that we got from Target. I also got some inexpensive curtain rods. Those are just some simple plain ones for our bedrooms. And then I got these ones for our living room. So we'll be putting those up. 
I got two of these, by the way, to go for the window behind me and on this window right here. So I got two of those. So let me show you what we got from Walmart. <laughs> we got two of these shower curtain liners and we also got two of these shower curtains right here. And you'll see why I said two because I'll show you guys how my shower is lined up. We got these curtains for the living room. We got two of those right here. And then we got two of these to hang some of our pictures. Also, diapers for Jackson and Joseph. Yes, he's in a two now, guys. Like, he's growing really, really fast, along with some other stuff. And then the regular refills on soap, trash bags, mouthwash, more of this stuff, bathroom stuff, some body wash, some plugins, some more toupees, nail clippers, deodorant, Vaseline, and face things. Well, <laughs> face things, face scrub. So I think I've covered pretty much everything that we bought today. So we are going to put the rugs up and put the curtains up in the living room. And I'm going to put my bed spread on my bed. And we'll just go from there. So, oh, I didn't show you guys one thing I got. I got a tissue holder also from, where did I get that from? Walmart. <laughs> so, yeah. Let's put this stuff together. Okay, so this is my shower curtain bar and this is how high it is. So you can see that I would need two because it's still open in the back. I'm trying to show you guys. So hopefully me having two curtains, taking this one down and having two curtains well, that's a little longer than this one will, you know, suffice. But this is what I was talking about and why we have two. So this is the rug. One second. And then these are the curtains. Don't mind them. I'm going to steam them. So... They come up much better. And there you have it. I just don't know what to do with that. This wall frame is just really small, so <sighs> that's the best that I can do. Okay, guys, so we are done in the living room. Um, all that we're gonna put in there for right now. I'm not too sure about the curtains. I think I can go a little longer, but we'll see how I feel about them once I steam the curtains. So when I do that, I'll take a picture of it, show you guys I'm not gonna do that tonight because I have to tackle my bedroom and I have to put the pillows and take whatever's on this bed and all of that off and put new stuff up there. So. We are going to do that, and we're going to do that quickly because I am getting a little tired. I just got finished um, making something to eat, washing some dishes, and you know, playing with the kids and all that stuff while my camera was charging. And now mommy's a little tired, and I'm ready to get into bed, but I have to make up my bed, so. Let's do that. Okay guys, so this is the finished product. That little wet stain over there on the pillowcase is the microband that I sprayed. And 
How you do, Joseph? Hello. <laughs> so, I cannot finish recording me making this bed. Oh, this is just some... I cannot finish recording me making the bed. This is how it looks around the trim. This is a king size bed. This frustrates me. Don't even look at how the window is not even centered, but the bed is. <laughs> uh, whatever. Okay, guys. So I couldn't even finish me recording the makeup of the bed because Joseph started getting extremely fussy because it is his bedtime and he wanted to be held and of course I gotta feed him and all that stuff to put him down. But I am missing um, two extra Euro pillows because I have the shams for them and I am going to probably pick those up tomorrow and put those on the bed. Um, that's Jackson if you heard that put those on the bed and that will make up the whole bed as a whole and yeah so I am going to get Joseph in the bed so I can shower and then I can get him to the bed all right so I completely knocked out after I took a shower and got the baby down to bed. It was just so peaceful, so I was able to get some rest and I completely forgot to end the vlog. So I am going to end the vlog here. I thank you guys for tuning in with me in my mesh together uh, segment <laughs> or vlogs or whatever it has you wanna call it. But I thank you guys for tuning in. I appreciate the love and all that you guys have given me thus far. Leave me a comment down below. If you're new here, introduce yourself. I love to meet you guys. And that is all. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. And if you enjoy my type of content. And I'll see you guys in another video. So until next time, bye bye. I'm just trying to keep it real. Let me love you on the inside.